All right, folks, loading up for a little flight here. Y'all join me. Let's do it. Thank you for giving me this uh, opportunity to fly you, bro. Hey, thank you know, for... I just learned to fly yesterday on YouTube. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Should be a good flight then, Captain. What's the range now? 200 miles, sir. They break 150 miles once they alert five aircraft. So you just learned to fly yesterday on, yesterday. You, on, on YouTube? On YouTube. I have a certificate. You got the YouTube certificate? Yeah. <laughs> All right, that's good. <laughs> Folks, he's, he's absolutely just joking. We're actually flying with two uh, senior pilots here. Damn it, Mustang. This is Ghost Rider 117. This bogey's all over with. It's got missile lock on me. Do I have permission to fire? We're just getting ready to start up. All right, folks, probably the last thing you can hear. We finna, we finna light this candle. And uh, my buddy Eric's over in the aircraft across the way. So we're about to launch the Alert 5 aircraft. Clear. Clear, clear, clear. clear.
150 miles, get him out of here. Bad, eh? Not bad, my for, friend. For a YouTube certified pilot. <laughs> YouTube. <laughs> stepping on any important parts wow that was awesome <laughs> folks that is such a beautiful view uh, too cool Folks, I want to tell you that's too cool. Um, flying in these ultralights. If you're uh, thinking about skydiving, but maybe skydiving is a little bit too much, uh, too much adventure, too scary for you, then you need to come fly in one of the ultralights because it's an absolutely beautiful view. Uh, just strap yourself in and enjoy the ride. Wow, I want to thank uh, everybody here for taking us up. But you know, if you're anywhere in Manila, Angeles City, uh, Subic, this is all uh, you know, 45 minutes, hour driving distance, somewhere in there. Plenty of parking out here. It's a nice country setting. Now this whole area that we're on, I don't know the whole story, but it's a country club, and they got uh, pools. I think a water park. I don't know, but there's a lot of stuff planned for this community here. And it's just beautiful. Right here in the middle of these mountains. What a way to spend a Saturday. What a way to spend a Saturday. So, uh, you know, shout out to our buddies, uh, Warner and Robert. Thank you very much for inviting us up here and taking us up. Folks, absolutely too cool. 
you got to do it. My goodness, what a great time. This is a spot you want to come hang out for a day. We got families over here that brought, uh, um, looks like mom, dad, and uh, you know, teenage daughter taking turns going up on the uh, on the ultralight. And they've got different, you know, you've seen the the footage. There's different uh, aircraft. So if you're not into the the open wind in the face, you can take the other uh, enclosed canopy over there and it won't be as uh immersive but you know it's up to you it's up to your adventure level um as to how exhilarating you want the flight to be but if you really want the full meal deal the full effect you take the ultralight that eric and i and, uh, and mercy took and it's a lot like skydiving but you know you've got a pilot in control you're in an aircraft and uh so if you're not, like I said before, if you're not as, as adventurous to go jump out of a plane, this is the next best thing to it, flying in these little ultralights. There you go. But if you don't want the, the open canopy experience, they do have aircraft that are, that are enclosed and you can fly in, get the same view, same experience. Okay, now obviously if you go up in the aircraft, you need to make sure everything's tied down. You know, everybody wants to film, whatever. Uh, make sure you have all your stuff tied off and dummy corded because it is an open cockpit. Um, just from a photography, videography standpoint, I had this uh, Rode Video Micro on the top. And once we got going, I'm like, why did I leave that on there? You know, see, I'm having to secure it. If you got any external mics or anything hanging off of your camera, just get rid of it because you can't hear the sound anyhow up there. Get, get some type of camera strap and secure that to your camera. That way, if you hit a little, a little bit of turbulence, uh, you're, you know, you're not worried about your camera coming loose. Have a safe flight home. Thank Enjoy. you. Sir. Thank you. Okay, no problem. Thank you. Thank you.